How do PEDX Live and PEDX defend against viruses? If PEDX Live is administered to the cell, the live virus antigen in it reaches to the small intestine. The antigen which reaches the surface of the intestine passes the M cells and is eaten by the dendritic cells. The dendritic cells move to the payer's patch where they deliver the information on the antigen to the helper T cells. The helper T cells deliver this data to the B cells. The B cells differentiate into memory cells and plasmoblasts, which then circulate in the blood vessels and persist in the mesenchymal lymph node, the spleen, the mammary gland, and so on. If PEDX is injected into the cell, the antigens are circulated in the blood vessels and stimulate the memory cells. At this time, the memory cells generate a much greater number of plasmoblasts than previously. The converted plasma cells secrete a large amount of IgA inside the mammary glands, so that when the piglets suck the breasts of the cell, the well-fed piglets will finally be able to defend against PED. An analysis of milk of a cell inoculated with oral PEDX live and PEDX showed that the IgA antibody, the core material for virus prevention, was much higher than that of the control group. And the comparison of clinical signs after virus infection also revealed that the vaccinated group infected had only mild symptoms and recovered soon. Seven days later, they weighed about the same as healthy pigs. In particular, the comparison of survival rates showed that the non-vaccinated group began to die on day two, and all of them died in five days, whereas the vaccinated group showed a 100% survival rate.